Okay, we move on. So how do we mix the coagulant in the water? There are two types of uh, methods. The first one is hydraulic methods, and the second one is mechanical methods. So the hydraulic method is called flume mixer. So how does it look like? So this is look. This is how flume mixer looks like. Okay, you can see the water traveling from aeration here, and then they are making a narrow uh, lane. So it causes turbulence of water. Turbulence of water. Water get mixed very, very uh, fast. I'm oh, sorry. Okay. So you can see a uh, perforated pipes there. So this is a pipe with uh, holes here. So all the uh, coagulant will be dropped from this uh, pipe. Okay. If you don't believe me, then this is another uh, picture of it. You can see that the, the alum or even the ferric chlorides are being added. Uh, through this perforated pipe. Then I have another clearer picture like this. Okay, so you can see turbulence water underneath. So these are the coagulant being uh, dosed into the water. That is a flow mixer. There is no movement, no mixing. They are all uh, hydraulic types. Okay, suddenly the water gets turbulence because of the they, they have a smaller lane for the water to travel. Okay, so that is the first one. The flu mixer. And the second one, we have the flash mixer. Okay, this is a mechanical method whereby you need electricity, you need something to stir the water, like this. Okay, this is what we call as flash mixer. Okay, you have to stir the water. It's like baking cakes. Okay, before you bake cakes, you have to mix them well, right? Using the, the mixer, the cake mixer. So, like this. Okay, so they also have a mixer here or the flash mixer so it will basically stir the coagulant in the water so you need electricity this is how we call as mechanical methods okay mechanical methods which flash mixer okay guys can we move on yes thank you for you know giving a response okay so those are the most common coagulant to be used and okay, the first one is alum Okay, the, the scientific name is aluminium sulfate, and this is a symbol. And then we have ferric chloride, ferric sulfate, and also cationic polymer. So I have a pictures of uh, alum. Okay, this is the alum. So it's a white thing, and it looks like this. Okay, if it is, if it is in Malay, it is called tawas. So people at kampung sometimes they are using tawas to treat their own water from well, from well water. So this is alum. I don't have uh, pictures of ferric chloride and ferric sulfate. Nonetheless, I do have the cationic polymers uh, picture. Normally, it's in the liquid. So this liquid will be perched into the, uh, into the system, into the water treatment plant. Okay, guys. So those are the types of coagulant.